There's, there's many reasons why I, I dislike Zayn and there's many reasons why I'll always, always be on his side. Liam Payne is getting real about where he stands with his former One Direction bandmate, Zayn Malik. While the 28-year-old singer made an appearance on a recent episode of Impulsive with Logan Paul podcast, Liam shared his candid opinion about Zayn after Logan recalled the feud his brother Jake Paul had with him back in 2020. At the time, Zayn's then-girlfriend, Gigi Hadid, came to the Pelotalk Talk singer's defense on social media, calling Jake, quote, irrelevant, and Zayn a, quote, respectful king. But Liam admitted that the social media exchange did not age too well. Gigi tweeted, at Jay calling yeah. him like ugly and irrelevant and that went crazy viral and you know Jake and is she ugly tweet, she tweeted something about, <laughs> but he's not irrelevant then she tweeted she tweeted something about get yourself like a respectful man or something yeah yeah that and one didn't age very well it didn't age <laughs> <laughs> Gigi and Zane who share one-year-old daughter Kaya called it quits late last year after he allegedly got into an altercation with the model's mother Yolanda Hadid according to court documents obtained by Access Hollywood Zane pleaded no contest to four counts of harassment. He was sentenced to serve a 90-day probation for each count, which totals to 360 days, and was also told he needed to attend anger management classes. Liam then went on to confess that there's, quote, many reasons why he disliked Zane, who left One Direction one year before the band ultimately broke up in 2016. And there's also, quote, many reasons why he'll always be on his side. Before we go too deeply into this, there's, there's, there's many reasons why I, I dislike Zane, and there's many reasons why I'll always, always be on his side. If I had had to go through what he went through, through his, gro his growth and, and whatever else, you know, your, your parents are very supportive. Very, very. Uh, my parents are overly supportive to the point where it's annoying at times, and they, they don't even <laughs> mind me saying that. And Zane, Zane had a different upbringing in that sense, and um, you can't, you can always look at the man for where he is and, and, and say, oh yeah, whatever, that guy's a d right? But at the end of the day, once you understand what he's been through to get to that point, and also whether or not he actually even wanted to be there. But Liam went on to note that he also isn't perfect, so we can't just call out Zane for his actions. I'm I'm so misunderstood my, by myself more than anyone. Like, I don't know why I'm, what I'm doing or why I'm here. It's like, I can't sit here and him because of whatever. And listen, I don't agree with any of his actions. I can't commend some of the things that he's done. I can't be on his side for that. What I can say is I understand and I hope that <laughs> Your only hope, hope is that at some point in their life, the person on the other end of the phone wants to receive the help that you're willing to give them.